In this video, I will share the best nail art ideas for short nails, as well as the worst one. Coming up! Hello, I'm Anastasia, I'm certified nail technician for 14 years and I'm willing to share the best ideas for short nails. And today we will be talking about specifically short nails with short nail beds. Because some people are lucky enough to have long beautiful nail beds and even if they file their nails as short as possible, they will still look gorgeous as soon as they apply any color. So today we will be talking about short nails that regardless if you have some length or not, they still look short. So first and good solution is using different color on each nail. And it can be ombre. Let's say you will take a sky blue color and go through the deep blue. Then it can be just dusty colors, let's say dusty pink, dusty blue and so on. It can be all pastel shades, all dark shades or just simply take all colors of the rainbow. It doesn't matter, it will still look cool. Second one is abstract designs and there are so many different kinds of abstract designs and most of them will perfectly work for short nails. Whether it's just abstract lines or some additional accessories such as foil, glitter or something else, just do not use too much on one nail. Remember, on short nails the space is always limited, so I simply recommend you to stick to at least three different colors within one design and then it will always look good. Marble designs. Whether you choose traditional marble or abstract marble, they will still look gorgeous. I only recommend on short nails to do more vertical or diagonal lines rather than to do them horizontal. And you can also use any shades that you like. It will always look good, even on short nails. Foil design. Recently, foil is trending again, so we can use transfer foil, we can use regular foil, it can be one color, it can be rainbow foil, it can be transferred almost fully onto the nail or it can be just half of it, it can be small pieces of foil, they can work as an ombre from free edge towards the cuticle, they can be particles on the sides, it's really up to you. The Ideas here are limitless and do not be afraid to use foil on this kind of nails. Geometrical designs, and there are so many different kinds of them, and you can use design with lines, with triangles, with circles, just anything you like. And honestly, I love geometric design mostly only on short nails. I think they really look so urban, so stylish, so unusual on extremely short nails. You know, when you don't have any background, it's just bare nail or at least some nude background and then you do this super thin lines added with some triangles. It just always look cool. I only recommend you to avoid really thick and wide lines on the, your design. Next is vertical lines and it doesn't have to be just one line. It can be in different shapes. It doesn't have to be just straight line. It can be something wavy. It can be lined with the leaves, with florals, with rhinestones, with anything. Because remember, all vertical lines that go from the cuticle towards the free edge, they always make nails look thinner and longer. And this is exactly what we want when working with short nails. So I recommend to take a look at these designs because they always look great on short nails. Minimalistic and thin florals. And I will say it again, minimalistic florals. Because floral flower design, they are just great. But when we have short nails, I would recommend you to have some limits. Do not use super big flowers and pop them on all 10 nails. It's better to take some small flowers, you know, to add them. It can be just a leaf with a flower, a line with a flower, or you can just use them on the free edge as French style because this will really underline the beauty of these nails and they will not look like overloaded. Besides good ideas, there are also some bad ideas. One of them is horizontal lines because they always make our nails look bigger. 
it's make them look fatter you know what I'm saying so uh, like I said any vertical lines will make them thinner whether the horizontal do the opposite and I've seen it so many times when clients come to you with a picture from Pinterest and they're like I need this and they showing me this perfect picture of a model super thin fingernails with a long bed and this one tiny line and it does look gorgeous on her but it will not look the same on the short nails especially if they're wide so I would recommend avoid horizontal lines whether they are thin or thick just it's better to switch on the vertical ones the same is fair for the ombre ombre is great for all kinds of nails whether they're short long any shape any color but you need to keep in mind that white color and also pastel colors that are close to white always make our nails look wider so I would not recommend using light colors on the free edge for short nails baby boomer is such a popular design and yes it does look gorgeous even on short nails but if the short nails are also wide on the free edge I would recommend to avoid baby boomer and choose some different color for the ombre let's say dark color or neutral or glitter no frames frames or outline design when you simply outline with the color the whole nail yes they look gorgeous as well as the shape of the nail only if there is a long nail or long nail bed unfortunately on short nails what it does it just simply makes them look even shorter and smaller and wider it's like expectation versus reality so just imagine that you have a nail which is tiny already and then you basically cut out this space by doing this frame making it look even smaller so please avoid frames on short nails what comes to application for short nails you can basically use any colors that you like I specifically love classic red and dark colors such as black brown dark blue purple on short nails I think they sometimes look even better than long nails and with colors there's just no limits my only recommendation is to avoid large particles in glitter because sometimes they do not look as good on short nails so these were my tips and ideas for good nail art and for bad nail art for short nails I hope it was helpful let me know what kind of designs do you prefer or if you're a nail technician what kind of designs do you do for your clients with short nails thank you so much for watching if this is your first time here on my channel consider subscribing as I post nail art tutorials and tips and tricks just like this one every week see you my next one. Bye!